Hello, my name is Mario De Aaron, and I'm an extension educator with the University of Idaho Extension. Um, my poster um, is titled University of Idaho Sustainable Agriculture uh, Project seeks to create a bioeconomy from dairy byproducts to increase nutrient recycling. Um, these, um, uh, first of all, I want to um, acknowledge my uh, co authors, uh, Dr. Mireille Shaheen, Dr. Linda Schott, and Dr. Mike McGuire. Um, this um, project um, is made possible by uh, funding by um, USDA NIFA, a Sustainable Agricultural Systems Grant. Um, and the aim of the project is to create the bioeconomy around dairy manure. This is a long-term project, it's a five years uh, grant. Um, and we named the project um, Idaho Sustainable Agriculture Initiative for Dairy, ISA. As I said, the objective is to create the bioeconomy around uh, dairy manure. And what that means is basically to try to extract uh, the different components, nutrient components of dairy manure um, and, and generate income for the dairy producers uh, based on the extraction of those components or um, the better use of the manure, which is a resource, uh, but uh, what is happening uh, is that in, in concentrated dairy areas, um, some um, fields are getting overloaded with manure. Um, meanwhile, other fields that could receive the manure or manure nutrients or components, uh, they are far away. Um, they are not uh, utilizing the resource. Um, so um, the project includes uh, three areas. Uh, one is research, uh, where we have several um, project uh, presented here in the poster. Um, the other one um, is um, um, education, uh, where we're going to generate um, courses uh, for undergraduate and graduate students uh, about uh, dairy manure and um, about uh, sustainability, dairy sustainability. Um, and the third uh, part of the project is a very robust ex extension um, project where we gonna um, educate uh, and communicate the results of the research um, to dairy producers, allied industry and um, government officials. Um, we can see here with the diagram kind of um, what we propose for the dairy bioeconomy as well uh, as well as the diagram on the different tools to improve nitrogen and phosphorus efficient during the handling and utilization of manure. Um, there are 25 research and extension faculty involved in this project as well as 24 graduate students from PhD to masters, uh, 37 undergraduate assistants as well as 15 section coordinators uh, or research or extension associate or assistants. Um, so a lot of people working and some of the projects we are working on is enhancing the composting uh, process using amendments to retain more nutrients, reduce emissions and generate a high-end product that can be transported farther away from the production area. Um, also, we are researching the use of cover crops uh, as interseeding dual cropping or double cropping to extract more nutrients from those soils that might be overloaded uh, with uh, manure nutrients at, at the time. Um, and also there's a way to hopefully generate uh, more income uh, for the farmers. Uh, there is enhanced solid manure solid separation that also gonna tie it up uh, with uh, processes like generation of uh, biochar or hydrochar um, as well um, as ammonia stripping that we can see here some pictures of the lab setting on the ammonia stripping. On all the uh, research components, we start with the lab or pilot scale, and then we go to a farm scale, and then we complete the cycle uh, on the fields to try those with crops. Um, and also um, 
we're going to produce a life cycle assessment and complete uh, economic impact uh, and social impact on the on the communities. Um, so there are other interesting um, projects included, like a bioplastic and a water um, the water machine that purifies the wastewater. Um, in summary, this this project is just starting. We are on the first year on, on a five year grant. Uh, so we are open to collaborations and, and invite um, graduate students that were interested in it um, to help us generate this, this bioeconomy around dairy manure. With that, uh, thank you. <laughs>